welcome back to another episode of Achilles Legends Untold. Uh, this will be episode 11. Uh, we are almost... We basically finished most of the things on this map. We have some rifts in this. We have... Mm, we have like... Because on, on the other map I closed just one rift. But the only thing is I don't have the location of them. I think the, uh, the map it's bugged. Or the game it's bugged, you know, so it's not showing me the location. I'm gonna try to push the main quest forward. Because we just been like in the labyrinth. So we fight the Minotaur, we get got the tools for the um, blacksmith. And now, uh, Pythia was sending us to this temple basically. I don't know what's the deal with this. My lacra, the specters again. I've defeated the likes of you before, so I can defeat you too. Okay, so now we fight two raids in the same time. They are called Nightmare. Fucking hell. They are shit. Uh, I think they have this. They move the one has like fucking hell. I think I need to lock targets. I'm gonna roll into that. Only thing with them is like that. I just got a crit on that. I need to be careful with this mask. They are like moving extremely fast as fuck. And that masks are annoying as fuck. But apparently they take a lot of damage. I just denied that one. Yeah, this was an easy fight. I've defeated the specters. I need to make sure there are no other traces of that being here. I could use my vision gifts to find them faster. I didn't even use my sword because uh, I just upgraded the sword uh, in the last episode. I guess it was. We were. Upgrading this, ah, but actually, we didn't have enough materials, I guess. Yeah, we need to take this on like slightly higher, so that's why we are using right now the spear, I guess. Uh, that's the thing, because I, I was talking about this in the last episode. Destroy the curse mask. Okay, so that one is a mess. Yeah, if we use this, so something here as well. Uh, that's what I was talking in the last episode because we kind of run out of materials. We are still on 2.2k now, but we need to upgrade our armor. We have to destroy one more mask. I don't know whether. Mm. Oh, it's here. The temple seems safe. Thank you, Achilles. You've freed the place I've been bound to for years, even though a lot has changed here. The temple was haunted by two specters, but I expelled them. I also found some masks with frightening countenances. The temple was erected in a place where the line between the worlds is very thin. They may have accumulated the energy of these specters, corrupting the place. I don't care about the masks. The most important thing is that you got rid of those ghosts. And I have a place where I can make your equipment. Achilles, I'm going to need another thing from you. I need an item infused with that being's power to maintain the integrity of my vision. 
I remember that one of the kidnappers was wearing a ring with that cursed symbol. I believe it will help us better understand what we're fighting against. Can you tell me more about the kidnapper? It was a bold man with a scar and black paint on his face. He frightened those hooded fanatics, so I assume he was their leader. Go look for him in the harbor. There is no shortage of bandits and troublemakers there. Maybe you'll come across his trail. I will return once I find out something about him. Okay, so let's see the blacksmith. Looking for a sturdy shield? Or maybe you prefer a more direct approach? What do you need? upgrade this but we need like bronze plates oh my fucking god for this we need like bronze fragments yes yeah, so actually this costs one bronze plate i don't know if i want to take it to 10 but Yeah, let's see. If I were you, I'd look for that kidnapper in the harbor. It was always full of suspicious people. Yeah, so let's let's remove the curse. Because I don't like being cursed, right? It's, uh, I think anyway the enemies respawn on the map as soon as we As soon as we logged back in into the game. So yeah. I know it was a chest here. This chest I don't know why I didn't unlock it in the previous one, but Yeah, I was expecting the race to be like mm. as soon as I saw two of them I was like thinking they will tank a bit more or they'll be like slightly more difficult at least. But apparently they were like quite easy to defeat, so I'm happy with that. But the thing is like, they were like too easy. <laughs> yeah, that, let's use this. This one. The spear is pretty, pretty damn good. But the thing is, like, I don't know where the fuck is the last. Kill the bastard! Kill the bastard. Right now I'm looking for this fucking rune, you know, on the fucking bro. I I hate this. <clears throat> He's like finding Waldo, bro. It's like what the fuck is this? We need like to find the must be the key to opening that chest. The middle of it, like. I have no idea where the fuck it hear me. Give me your body, bastard. Oh, the way I'm smashing them up. Yeah, I guess that's why I didn't unlock the chest because I couldn't find that shit. Someone's looking for trouble. Who the fuck is looking for trouble? You, you idiot! I'm just walking around. And you are like looking for trouble for fuck's sake. 
And the thing is, like, I don't know. I have no idea where the fuck is that rune, you know, because we need to find a fucking symbol on the walls. I think he's on the walls, because to be f oh, look, he's here. The chest should be open now. Okay, so let's open the chest. Where the fuck was the chest? Okay, in this. Uh, in the previous episode, I was like fighting the Minotaur. Unfortunately, he was like a lame boss. But the same shit with this one. There were like two of them. I was expecting like them to be way tougher than this. But I just used the, the, the thorns, you know. So they fucking die like, pretty easy. I'm extremely aware of dual wielders because they are like a... I've been playing that build so I know how deadly that can be but because we are like extremely tanky right now we don't give a shit about damage like bro this spear is Pop off the food chain. Why? Why? I need to fucking target properly. It's funny because sometimes I'm I'm just pointing at one of them. And both of them got get like hit it by by the attack. Just stop, must stop chaining. So let's move on with the quest. I'm trying to follow the the map to the quest. It's basically we explore kind of everything. We have these monuments like to unlock, but I don't know if I have enough materials to unlock them. So. And we still have the fucking rifts on the first map, you know, but because I don't know their location. I didn't even check because yesterday it was like pretty late. So I didn't really have time to check for it, you know. And today I was jumping straight into it and it's pretty late as well. I was like, fuck it, I'll better record it, because I just want to finish this game, you know? For me, this game was like... I'm I'm mainly playing like RPGs. I can... I'm playing like shooters as well, you know? Mm, I'm playing plenty of games, but I, I wanted to record this, because I thought it would be like an interesting one. But unfortunately, after four or five hours in game, I realize it's not really like the the best game to record. You know what I mean? What do we have here? Another lost lamb? I'll find a place for you too. Release these people, and I'll let you go and think about your life. <laughs> <laughs> their, their time has it come. <laughs> he who is marked is waiting for the Lord's orders. When he receives them, they will play their part. And then everything will begin. That's enough of this nonsense. Kill the bastard! <laughs> 
Okay. You who's smart? I'm curious who, the, who is the one mark. So basically, okay, we need to release them. I saw how that madman tried to. Just the thought of it makes me sick. I'll beat you bloody. Not yet. Okay. That motherfucker was like jumping over. I think he's some type of superhero. What the fuck is wrong with him? Yeah, but meanwhile, let's, we have to release all these prisoners, apparently. Yeah, and like I said, I, I'm feeling like this is not the best game to record. It's an interesting game, but it's nothing like challenging. I thought it, it's about mechanics and things, but... We are on the hardest difficulty. They said that they would tie us up to locks and offer us to their lord, and that our souls will serve him for eternity. When they were interrogating me in their hideout, the bold madman with painted face kept talking about him. Do you remember where exactly that hideout is? Go along the shore toward that large square, the former site of city gatherings. Near it, there is an entrance to the underground. Hide with the rest. I'll take care of him. Yeah, that's really fair. I don't know how to thank you, stranger. Get the horse! <laughs> I hate when they block, they are blocking my attack. I already opened that. Warrior. Thank you a hundredfold for the rescue. Look a mask up here. Passage to the underground near the square. I need to get Too fast. The thing is like Just because I saw that mask, I'm trying to see if we can find more masks. Using like my lady, get the fuck out! I don't want to kill him by accident, me lady. She don't give a shit. Yeah, and after four hours in game, I realized this game is not like the best game this to record. Be the you pull them all. Oh. 
Yeah, apparently. Yeah, I tried to dodge it, but it wasn't really working. Okay. We managed to defeat this one. This trap is open. Okay. Okay. So. Well, well, well. A hero that returns. I've heard of you, Achilles. My lord has foreseen that you'd soon pay me a visit. Know that he will surely appreciate your voluntary sacrifice. Why are you kidnapping people? <laughs> I'd most gladly throw them to the lions, but my lord has recognized a potential in them, and in his generosity, let them serve him, even after death. They will join his ranks that are awaiting his sign, and then I, his most loyal servant, shall lead them to war that will drown Greece in blood and fear! Why are you so certain that it's you who's going to lead them? It just so happens. I also spoke with your lord. He said that he sees similarity between us, and that he admires me. Admires you? You're lying. Lying like a dog. You want to deprive me of my honor? Only I am worthy enough to sit beside him! And as a token of that, I shall give him your head! Uh, good luck with that idiot. This is Tidius. Tidius is like the guy who fucked up Pollux, the guy which we killed. Which he wanted the honorable death. This guy has like nice sword. Bro, you are the slowest motherfucker. I don't know how the fuck you are dual wielding and you are so fucking slow. That's a nice attack. I'm trying to see what the fuck he can do. I dodged into it. on the altar of war for some lore to take away my glory my glory i didn't come here for glory i came here to punish you for your crimes <laughs> you bold fool you'll be begging for mercy what the fuck is this motherfucker wrong how the fuck this one I was like defeating. I think Pollux could defeat this motherfucker. This is so slow, this guy. This these boss fights are like pathetic as they can't close gaps. The that's the main issue with this game basically. All the bosses are daft as fuck. They can't really close gaps, like they, they're like just having some attack patterns which are shit. How the fuck that one missed? My guy is even... I just jumped over it. Yeah, almost impressive. Get the fuck out. Kill this idiot. You are too dangerous to let leave. The Greek citizens will be relieved when they learn of your death. 
Yeah, so we defeated Tidius. Here we got his ring. Oh, we have a new fucking. Here we have a new fucking weapon. We released someone. We, ah, okay, we released the uh, a prison in like. I want to see if there are any masks inside of this. And apparently, they are not. Yeah, the boss fights are lame in this game. I don't know. Till now, I couldn't really find like a challenging boss fight. Everything is like so easy if you fight 101. Bro, from, from where the fuck I'm getting this pure shit? Yeah, the dogs are annoying as fuck. The wolves, like. And even these idiots, you know, because they can block and knock you down, like, it's nothing. That's what I hate about this game. It's... In the previous video or somewhere like that, I... I point... I... I Martin that timestamp just two archers which, which managed to, to stun lock me just two archers and I was like what the fuck is that shit because it's points two archers you know to, to fuck with you like so bad bro Guys, come the fuck on if you are charging me, come all of you, you fuckers. Because I'm not fighting just two. It's a waste of... Nah, I'm stupid now. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm stupid. And... Yeah, he can... He can block that shit. Okay. Have mercy. Have mercy. Some of the citizens are just pure idiots. Come on, guys. Why the fuck? Why stop attacking me, you fucking retard. Bro, how many idiots are, bro? You kill four of them and four more are, are spawning on top, you know what I mean? It's like, not spawning, but just fucking coming from the other side of the map. And this spirit is sometimes just ridiculous. But, I love the, the torn skills on it. The thorns are badass. Okay, let's let's use one potion. I'm looting all these ones, thinking like they are like plates. Because I really need materials. To upgrade weapons like and armor. So mm, let's see. I wanna visit this one, maybe we unlocked it. Yeah, let's take that one out of the... And to be fair with you, I wanna scout for masks as well, you know, because I saw... 
I found a mask into oh my fucking god look how many they are bro they are flanking me yeah the nice part about this you can dodge skills with the leap that That leap you can really dodge things up like So somewhere here needs to be the Yeah the monument To dig head Bones of the beast For this I need to defeat skeletons Oh, it guys, what the fuck? I shouldn't lock target on that shit. Too fast. Too fast. Yeah, so. We still need like pure essence of darkness, pure essence, uh, bones of the beast. But I can't get b bones of the beast if I'm defeating like normal humans. You know what I mean? So that's another thing. I need to find skeletons. But I don't know where the fuck they can find. I know there were like some places on this map, but I don't remember where, where exactly. Because there were like some plants at one point. There were like three plants and some skeletons were like coming, but raising up and attacking me as well. This is the ring. Its owner was the right hand man of the being we're looking for. It beams with a powerful force. The same one I felt at the sealed doors. I hope it can help direct my vision. The line between the world of the living and the dead is very thin here. I don't know how powerful my vision will be or what consequences it will bring. Remember everything you're about to hear and don't get Boy Christemas, skiers don't the crow. Boy the fuck he fainted I hope so he's not dead <laughs> damn it so it's time who are you there's no time to explain take care of them I'll protect the oracle who the fuck is this guy is Thor what the fuck is wrong with him go face 
face the enemy, Achilles. I'll protect the Oracle. Bro. Instead of instead of sitting there like a fucking cunt, come and help me, you fucking dickhead. These NPCs, bro, they are like pathetic, I swear to god. It's like Where the fuck we need to go? I don't Oh we need to come here. Oh fucking idiot spawning on top of me now. This is annoying as fuck. Essence of Darkness, okay, so from cultist I can get that shit. So now I can go back. What the fuck are these quests, bro? Uh, put it like this, guys. This game is on the hardest difficulty, yeah? So I'm trying to do a deathless run, my first gameplay. My first playthrough, like. Until now, I didn't found any challenge. Lord. You gave them hell, Achilles, as always. Well done. You better explain what I just saw. Well, I wanted to get away from my past, but things turned out differently. You've already met my uncle, Hades. Long ago, I was the patron and god of fire, smiths, and craftspeople. They called me Hephaestus. And you're only telling me this now? I just, uh, I just didn't want to be a god anymore. I imbued this hammer with my power and hid it far away from everyone. If I had to choose between one evil and another, I'd rather not choose at all. But since the fate of Greece is at stake, I couldn't remain passive. Help, especially divine help, is now immensely needed. Dispense with the courtesies. After all, we've known each other for some time now. You better check on the Oracle. I think she's regaining consciousness. Yeah, I don't know. Hepatitis, you fucking... He has hepatitis, bro. We have this sword. It's getting with endurance. Let's see if we upgrade it. It's... 8 damage. Hmm... I don't know. I need to wait for more fucking... In the same time, I wanna see if I'm equipping that sword with... Let's say, I change this axe. Yeah, this sword doesn't have the best attack moves. It has like a fucking 30% crit chance. Both of them, but this one is way better. Yeah, in the same time, if this is equipped and I'm going for endurance, ah, it's granting just two damage, it's not a lot. Even if it's scaling with. Yeah, it's fucked up. It scales with wrath. This is the best one, and this is the best shield. Yeah, so let's talk to Pythia. Basically, she's the oracle. I'm still feeling dizzy. What happened? Hades spoke through you. He warned me about the enemies that attacked the temple. Have... I mean, the smith will explain everything in due time. Now you must rest. Before the darkness overcame me, I saw something else. I saw them. They were like giant shadows stretching over the horizon. I saw the arrival of the three heralds of terror. The first one came from the plains, the second from the sea, 
the third from the mountains. Flame, plague, and madness trailed behind them. Stop them, Achilles, and bring me something that belongs to them. I believe the power enchanted in such objects will allow me to see where Phobos is hiding. Okay. Time to find those heralds and stop them. Whoever they are. Thinking now, Phobos is the serpent, uh, that snake which we saw. You butchered my flock, mortals. Big shot, what the fuck is going on now? So we found some skeletons, but I don't know if we... Look any bones. Fuck you, dead. These fucking plants can be extremely annoying. Oh, no, don't focus them. Where the fuck we need to go? So. We have one, one over there, sorry, that was my, hmm, yeah, let's teleport, oh, well, actually, let's fight this, okay, Bones of the Beast, okay, we got some, We need like 100 bones of the beast. You know what I mean? So we're gonna need loads of them. Now I think we need to defeat three bosses. Heralds of Terror. Kill that bastard. So I was fighting, I was engaging three motherfuckers and suddenly five more showed up. I don't know from where the fuck these ones came. some bronze plates not shards for fun Get him. Take him. Why? 
as king, who devoted his life to seeking revenge for his brother's death. He was so focused on that goal that he brought the dogs of war into his own kingdom. Sounds familiar. I don't know. Oh. Come on, boy. What do you. What's your special uh, ability like? He can set shit on fire. This is a bit dark. Come on, do something. Let's see, because now he's below half HP, so... What the fuck, I got stuck into this. Check, check this game bro, check this game, I got stuck into these things, these fucking fans while I'm fighting a fucking boss, you know what I mean? And look, now I can't really move, Jesus, this game is lame as fuck bro. You are fighting a boss and suddenly you get stuck in some fucking retard texture, you know what I mean, it's pathetic as fuck. Okay, so we defeated one of it. This one was like lame. I don't know how to put it like. But he was just lame as fuck. We can teleport. Oh, this one. He looks badass. Game mechanics, bro. is categorized as a fucking souls like game bro they understand mechanics like if i wanted to dodge that shit i could dodge it check that amount of damage my boy just got fucked. Man, these bosses are pathetic. We can't even call them bosses, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, let's upgrade a bit. Scale 3. Let's get this, let's get this again. So we have like the whale, it's at maximum. We can go for... 
points in this. So one more, more point into HP. Let's teleport to the other one. Okay. You found my quarters. I admit that at first I had a tough time containing his wild nature. I curse. Oh, this is a. Uh... Bro, this is a. Uh... Oh, but shut the fuck up! I'm talking, bitch. So this this guy is Agamemnon. Agamemnon. You you remember that boss fight? He was having like throwing fire instead of. Cause I remember I bugged him. Yeah, he was doing that. I bugged him. Look that shit. I was like putting it on top of him. Cause I managed to bug him some or glitch him somehow. This I swear to God, this is Agamemnon. But Agamemnon was like fi uh, throwing fire. This motherfucker is throwing po throwing poison, like. And I wanted so bad that fucking axe or. What the fuck is that shit? <laughs> Sorry, I was like just sneezing. Fucking hell. Yeah, this, this, this game is lame as fuck. Look, this is a boss fight. Are you fucking kidding? How you can call this a boss fight? This idiot is just pathetic, he's like stucking himself in texture because I know texture is fucked up. But the thing is even he is getting stuck in, in texture, you know, that's the most pathetic thing. I swear to god this is Agamemnon, it's exactly the same boss, exactly the same attacks and exactly the same movement pattern, you know, because even his movement is the same. But the only difference is like that, that guy was like throwing uh, fire instead of poison, you know, that's the only thing. fucking god this game is ridiculous bro this game is fucking ridiculous bro if you if you follow up the story of this main quest bro this guy is lame the lines were lame as fuck uh so much hatred bro we don't hate we have no fu everyone is fucking swearing on us cursing us Everyone is fucking attacking us, and we are the ones who hate. What the fuck is wrong with this guy, bro? 
Who wrote the fucking story on this? Bro, they are like brain dead. And now, that guy was like trying to put it like, oh, maybe we don't need to fight, just denounce your own god, basically to denounce Hades, yeah. But I'm curious if we have the option to do that. Because I bet you don't have that option. Because in this game you don't have options. It's not looking like you have options. I don't know what I mean. Everything's happening around you. And you are like just spectating like. You, you can't interfere with the story. Till now I couldn't interfere with the story or to have a... To choose, you know? Like to have like a... Option to choose, no? Till now I was just like... Everything was moving straight forward, like, you know what I mean? This game is lame as fuck, bro. And the writing is shit. The storytelling is shit. I can understand the way they wanted to put it, bro, but if... Come on. You have... The game is called Achilles Legends Untold. Let's focus. Legends untold. Bro, you can invent whatever you fucking want, bro. And this is the only thing which they can fucking... I don't know. I'm like... I, I'm... I'm just amazed, bro. Like, their stupidity. And these guys... Again. These guys are... Having like training courses now for whoever wants to enroll to learn game developing and story fucking telling bro who the fuck bro my my head is like just fucking hurt we have another motherfucker no hero <laughs> that guy missed everything I swear. I don't know if you saw that one guy. This motherfucker missed everything. And he was next to me like. Game mechanics bro. Game mechanics. I played this because <laughs> when I read you know in on store on Steam store like the page you know it was like oh this game is a mix in between rpg and the uh, souls like with hack and slash elements <laughs> which i i was fine by because i don't mind it you know i played like path of exile i played like some games i played uh Wallace, if you are familiar with the game but this one is just This game has graphics, but that's everything that it has. It's, it's nothing more, just graphics. And I swear to God, I'm still amazed how a company like them, they want to teach people how to do game development, bro. What the fuck? What game development, bro? This game is like a fucking bad joke. It's not even, I can't even call it a game, I swear to God. It's like a try, you know what I mean? This game is like a try, okay? They tried. And the standards of games nowadays, bro, they drop like big star, bro. The games nowadays are meant to be played by any fucking retard, bro. You know, they are in favor of retard. We have no challenge, no nothing. For a guy who played like Sekiro, all the Soul, Dark Souls games, I played even Lords of the Fallen, I enjoyed Lords of the Fallen. It was like the best game, but it was decent. Uh, But at least they, that games have mechanics, you know what I mean? That games have like, 
I don't know if you played Remnant. I played Remnant with some for some friends. That it was fun, bro. I recommend you to play Remnant too in co-op because it's funny as fuck. Uh, but this game, what the fuck, bro? This game is a joke. It's a one of the worst jokes I ever played. Who is this motherfucker? Why do you wanna fight, bro? On this, check the the AI, bro. Check the AI. I swear to God, this game is like a joke, bro. This game is like a joke. Let them spawn. Let them spawn even more of them. I need to fight like... I need, I need to gather like bones of the beast. Yeah. Let's exploit. I need to... To stop attacking that motherfucker. Now I need to separate this from the other one. I need to focus on this idiot and now he'll summon again. Yeah, come on, come on, but this is just three. He's dead, but he's still talking. I'll beat you bloody. And he's a fucking specter or a wraith. Yeah, say so. Why the fuck they have the same lines? The same three lines which I heard from the beginning of the game. Why we fight the same fucking opponents over and over and over and over again, bro? Why? I was hoping I'm gonna reach this fucking map and we're gonna have like new fucking enemies, you know what I mean? Like fucking new type of enemies, like mechanics, new bosses, like bosses which, bro, at least they can challenge your gameplay a bit, you know what I mean? When I, on episode 4, I, say, I said on the end of the episode 4, I said I will be the final boss without using a potion, bro. And... That will happen, trust me. When you fight 101, you don't need potion. Bro. It's the the AI is so daft, it can it will you know it will do some damage, yeah. Cause you trade. I don't know if you saw the last three bosses, because we just fought like three bosses, yeah. They were like I can't call them bosses, they were like elites, yeah. So we fought these three idiots, yeah? These three idiots, you could beat them flawlessly. But the thing is, as soon as you try to do like a... If you use like your 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 special skills, you'll beat the shit out of them instantly. You're gonna beat them like in seconds, bro. But the thing is, if you go in close combat with them, they will trade with you. So that's the only reason you get damaged because you get stuck in an animation because you're gonna do a leap attack yeah as soon as you are leaping he's like fucking attacking as well and you're gonna do damage you're gonna do damage and that's it but if you are using special skills like this one like this you know we have like just few of them because this is the game about I said, why the fuck they didn't put, you know, skills on fucking weapons, bro. Place skills on weapons. Putting a skill, like an individual skill, like every single weapon to have his own unique skill. It will make these fucking useless weapons viable. You're gonna use them just because of that skill and you, your brain will gonna think on some combos of skills to use 
the you know beside the special skills you're gonna have like some nice you know combat because maybe it will force me to do to use this winged axe yeah and let's say this yeah and now your attacks are slower but they can unlock some nice skills you know what i mean not not to spam the same skills over and over and over again because if you are a dual wielder i'm telling you from this is what you want this is the attack you want this this is a 360 fucking the first attack in the chain is a 360 if you spam this if you learn the timing and you spam this bro you won't get hit trust me you won't get hit by anyone it will be you know the roid guys the big ones which are charging you they will knock you down but if you do this so you don't continue the you don't do this yeah you are doing just this you learn the timing basically and that's it bro and that's it that's the game it's easy as that you know it's fucking easy if you are trying to use dual wielding i recommend you using this and heavy sometimes if we're gonna get some nice fucking skills aoe skills we're gonna fucking we're gonna fucking rip their head out without even getting hit you know what i mean but what a lame game bro combat zero i swear to god combat mechanic zero bro challenge zero because i swear to god i'm not bro i i i love a challenge i love when when i need to learn fucking timing you know on a boss just because uh if you remember that in dark souls 3 you have the fucking guy the fighting i don't remember the the boss name but the one which is coming on top of a fucking dragon bro and you're fighting clouds like in fucking skies bro that fight was so fucking annoying bro i was getting frustrated even though after like fucking 15 tries or 30 tries i managed to defeat him but i was like it was a learning curve in this one you are doing the same shit all game all, all the fucking 15 20 hours how long the fucking game lasts you're gonna do the same attacks over and over and over again i tested all the weapons in the game all the types you know all types of weapons all shit they are pathetic the game is pathetic the writing is pathetic everything about this game is pathetic beside gra game graphics and this button you know this unstuck button it's legendary but that's everything i defeated the heralds of terror you saw i heard phobos voice near them he sounded much stronger than before by defeating his chosen ones you have dealt him a blow he is weakened but doesn't let it show you think i have a feeling that whatever i touch i only make it worse many years ago i tried to end the war i failed and if that's not enough i couldn't save my own soldiers from death later i challenged the one who unleashed that war when suddenly by a weird twist of fate Phobos appeared and drowned Greece in chaos before my very eyes. Greece has been drowning in chaos for many years, Achilles. The appearance of someone like Phobos was only a matter of time, and not your fault. It's normal to feel doubt, but remember this. If it weren't for you, I would have died along with all the other priests. Your courage caused things to turn out differently. I know one thing for sure. As long as Phobos is alive, Peace won't return to Greece. In that case, we have to do everything we can to expel him from this world, once and for all. I'll examine the things you've brought me, and you should talk to Hephaestus. As far as I know, he has an important task for you. Hippocytus, come here, my friend. What the fuck are you telling me to do? Go and go, my fucking man, bro. The hardest boss, to boss of this game, guys, was Paris. But Paris beat me just because I didn't, it was the first fight, I didn't have a massive health pool. And the only mechanic which is killing you in that fucking fight 
is the f that arrow which is automatically tracking you down and it's limiting it's basically it's draining your hp but it's draining your maximum hp that's the only that's the only cause that motherfucker paris defeated me when i fought him on the beginning of the game i took him to fucking 30 40 percent damage uh, hp but trust me with one hp i was like doing like around 15 percent of his damage with one hp and as soon as i realized how i can beat him he fucking one shot me you know because i was one hp but even for even that uh, that parties i can beat the shit out of him if i'm starting the game now i i'm i can prove you i can i can defeat that motherfucker this game has no challenge i swear to god i swear to god it's no challenge this game and now i need to speak with hepatitis i heard you have an important task for me the enemy you're going to face doesn't come from this world it has a power mightier at its disposal than all the enemies you've fought so far for you to have a fighting chance, I need to forge you armor worthy of the gods themselves. However, such work requires extremely rare, raw materials. Supposedly a beast with claws harder than the hardest iron alloy once prowled the area. Material of this grade will be invaluable for my new work. Where should I look for this beast? The thing is, I have no idea. You won't do without an expert hunter's help. A large group of refugees from my scene arrived recently at the harbor. Possibly you'll find a hunter among them. In that case, I'm off to find one. Don't tell me that stupid Lysander. Remember Lysander, the hunter we we helped in fucking beginning of the game? If he is the expert hunter, bro. Bro. Fuck this. Fuck this shit. And now he wants to craft me a better armor. Yeah, but why you don't sell me a better armor, bro? Why we have in this game, we, we play with this. Oh, we can buy this shit now. Why I have to play with the same stupid fucking armor over and over and over and over again? You wanna upgrade this because it's a fun weapon to use. It's not costing a lot. We have no money. <laughs> Fuck this shit. Yeah, bro. Bro. The woman I rescued from the hands of Tydeus's man seems well informed. So if I was dying there, I was dying just because I was surrounded by fucking anti enemies, bro. Not because this game is hard. It's daft mechanics, you know. So that's why I use this skill because this is making me immune to damage. Immune. But this game is a fucking joke. Teleport. Let me teleport. Because I, I don't understand why it's taking my camera and pulling it over here. I don't know why it's doing that. Let's teleport here. I don't want to walk in this game anymore. Because I'm tired. And I guess that's why I'm like so... I'm bored as well, you know, because, bro, I'm fighting the same enemies from the beginning of the game, bro, you know. These motherfuckers were in the first map, but they were they were wearing red armor. These motherfuckers, you're gonna fight, find them in, like, occult, like, cultist, yeah. Cultist, which are, like, basically have some different appearance. These motherfuckers, you're gonna find them as bandits, yeah the same shit they have the same attack 
moves, the same fucking patterns, the same fucking... This game is a copy-paste, bro. And what's frustrating me the most is these guys are pretending they are like doing training courses, bro. Teaching, teaching new, new guys who wants to get into the trade of developing fucking nice games, you know. They want to, to just spoil them with these fucking shits, bro. Because they will sell the key of how, how to fucking make a game. No, bro, you're gonna learn someone basic shit things which they can learn on youtube bro ai in like next five years the ai will make better games than this bro i'm telling you way better game than this. this is just lame as fuck and i'm tired I, I, i'm tired as fuck of fighting the same seven types of enemies or 20 types of enemies, you know, because you have some insects, you have wolves. If you show me a difference in between a wolf and a lion, just the parents is different, but they have the same shit. Uh, you have like that spider crabs, I'm calling them spider crabs, yeah. So you have the ones which are like poison, the ones which are doing like fire, and the ones which are like black, and I, they are doing, I guess some dark damage you know curse shit but they are all the same and they have exactly the same attacking move the scorpions the basic scorpions i fought like a fucking boss scorpion king scorpion king was like a basic scorpion with a, like he was bigger and he has some armor plate that was everything he couldn't charge, he couldn't do like some fucking thorns around him, you know what I mean? Like surrounding him 360 so you won't be there smashing his fucking brains onto the wall. Just making you play safe on distance, you know? No, you need... You, you, these guys are pathetic. I'm looking for yeah, it's just pathetic, I swear to God, I, I can't you know find anything. Like if he was in the last group of refugees, he should be in the village near the swamps. But I'm afraid you're too late. How come? People say that a great beast attacked the village. A few defenders faced it, but didn't stand the slightest chance against it. If he managed to survive, it must have been some miracle. I need to try and find him. Thanks for the information. Take care. If you believe the rumors, that beast is a true monstrosity. Yeah, I want to fight that monstrosity. Let me tell you something. I'm not gonna use any potions on that monstrosity. I'm gonna beat the shit out of that monstrosity without even, bro. This game, bro. Kill the bastard. What they can do to kill you? Spawn fucking 20 enemies next to you. Look, you are trying to run out from them, and more of them are like popping up. You can't really run out from them because they are over everywhere, bro. all over the fucking map. Bro. Kill that bastard! Kill that bastard! And I heard that kill that son of the whore, kill that bastard, like so many times. My head is like fucking hurting. Trust me. This game is not a challenge; it's a mental challenge. For whoever plays this shit, is a mental challenge. It's like nothing. It's just a test of patience, basically. That's what, how I'm seeing this game. And after fucking 15 hours in this game, I am allowed to say that shit. Malaka, the traces suggest something huge run through here. I need to assess the situation and find the hunter. And this is Lysander, I'm telling you, this is Lysander, bro. Look, he's the must, the, the expert Lysander? hunter. Lysander? What, I'm what telling. are you doing here? After Cleothi's death, I wanted to take my own life. But I met this family. They wouldn't be able to survive in the wilderness and around for long. So I helped them. When we saw that the old gate near my scene was open, we went to the harbor and then to this village. However, the war has reached us here too. By the way, what are you doing here? 
I need to hunt down a beast whose claws are tougher than iron. Supposedly, it's prowling the area. I saw it running through the locals and charging through the village. These madmen in black robes must have started it. Until now, I thought these creatures existed only in fairy tales. But my eyes did not lie. It was a chimera. Check if anyone in the village managed to survive and bring these people to me. Meanwhile, I'll prepare something that will help you hunt this monster down. Well, we need to find a chimera, bro. This, this idiot, you encounter him on the first map in the dark woods. This idiot, so just, just for you to, in case you didn't play the game or you didn't saw it, this idiot took his daughter to hunt some shits, yeah. Bandits showed up. This motherfucker went with the bandits or he ran away. Her daughter ran away on the opposite direction, I guess. She's getting killed by a wolf. Well, he's like a hostage to the bandits, bro. Why he didn't run with her? Why he didn't try to fight them? Why he didn't, bro? That's right. This this guy, and what, what is recommending this motherfucker as an expert hunter, bro? What What is recommending him as an expert hunter? He has no fucking armor. He wears a fucking dress, bro. He has a dress. Which hunter wears this when he's going hunting? Like maybe... I don't know. Like in prehistoric times, something like that, you know? The beginnings of humanity, yeah, maybe they were like hunting like this. But he has no bow, no no fucking armor on him, no bows, no fucking swords, no nothing. If I'm going now in town and you're gonna see so many guys looking the same as him. It's like, why they are not hunters? And what, why this is the expert hunter? Who the fuck is this motherfucker, bro? A coward cunt who left his daughter to die. This is our expert hunter, bro. Please save everyone we can. Each moment counts. Go oh, fuck yourself. Bro. This game is just. It's just lame. So now. We have one, two. Let's do this. And after I'm gonna quit because I'm my head is just hurting I swear. <laughs> Playing this game is like bro I, I'm telling you guys it's You can play this having YouTube open you know watching some fucking documentaries or whatever you want to see on YouTube mute this sound and play it as a farm simulator can get our bone Damn it. Not a living soul. I must keep searching. Yeah, bro, keep searching for a living soul, bro. You are the Kill the He's full of hatred. That's what Phobos said about him. But our guy is saving everyone, trying to save everyone finds you know he's the one full of hatred look see you have dual wielders you have archers this is a cultist archer we're gonna have bandit archer as well we're gonna have fucking red shit hunter like we're gonna have blue shit hunter on this map but not not a single new enemy all of them are copy paste different appearance the same shit same fucking four attacks
I picked this. I was stuck. Yeah. Just for you to understand, I was stuck there. I couldn't move. Look here. It's something which is not allowing you to move. Here. I was stuck in this. This insect, they have like three skins, three types of skin. These plants are in a way unique. You don't see them like copy pasted. But we're gonna encounter them on all maps, so in a way they are copy pasted. And they said this game may become frustrating. Please make those sons of bitches pay for it. May they perish in agony. I'll take care of them. You should find shelter. Play this game on the hardest difficulty. They recommending to you. They are recommending you to have a deep understanding into mechanics and bullshit, bro. Bro, <laughs> what, <laughs> what, <laughs> what mechanics, what they are talking about, what mechanics, bro? Because all you are doing, you are doing the same fucking attacks over and over and over again. You know what I mean? And they are spawning fucking hundreds of enemies. And you fight like, because I guess my kill count... It's around something like 5,000 deaths at least, bro. And I'm not... They, they couldn't kill me till now. I wasn't dying. I, it's not like I wasn't dying. It's... I had like a perfect run, you know what I mean? Like my guy is unkillable. And they are like telling you, oh, be aware, the, the archers are deadly. Yeah, you know why the archers are deadly? Just because every single mob in this game can stun lock you, that's why. And they can stun lock you from distance. That's the only way why they are deadly. But these fuckers, you see the dual wielders, they are deadly as fuck, trust me. I think they are like um, one of the most deadliest motherfuckers. But archers are deadly. I'm not gonna say I'm prioritizing archers because they can stun lock you from distance. But at the same time, close combat wise, dual wielders are the the biggest threat. I'm not one of them. I came to save you. Save us? God. And I thought you were one of those lunatics. Run toward the harbor straight. My friend will take care of you there. And even Pythia. Even Pythia, the oracle. She said something last time. In one of that line. She was eating shit, bro. It was like the shit eater. Because our guy was saying something, oh, he died anyway. Paris killed him. Phobos wasn't even like there, you know? We didn't even know about Phobos. I don't even understand it. Story is full of bullshit. It's not making any sense to be fair with you. It's, it's not making any sense. For me at least. It's... 
Oh, they, they just to kill you, they put like three plants here. Yeah. Okay, maybe he will get killed. This game is like a test of patience. They really Hey, what else we need to do? Let's open this shit because maybe we're gonna find more math. This Look, you get stuck in something like this. That was nice. My friends are doing that. I'm sorry for you. Man. I like them the most. You can see shrines bro. This motherfucker is the shrine master. He can spot shrine, he's the eagle eye. But that's the only thing he can spot, just shrine, you know what I mean? Because besides shrines, he can't see shit. Let me rest just to remove the curse. Because I'm not gonna allow them to curse me again. You know what I mean? How many enemies are on top of me? You know what I mean? It's like we are fighting like fucking bro, an army, and I managed to dodge that stuff. This is a metal motherfucker. Yeah. So, 
I don't even know why I was what I was doing there. Anyway, we have a chest there and more, more shit. Look how many there. He wanted to cut. I can understand why they put like so many of them. Just because you need to, you need like twenty pure uh, essence of the darkness and uh, one hundred that shit skeleton shit. The gods themselves must have sent you here. I won't ever forget that. Voila. I won't find any more survivors. Time to return to Lysandra. Return to the master hunter now. I need to return to the the master. He's the expert bro. This game is for the ones who likes to do the same shit over and over again. For a guy like me who has like ADHD, I can't really do this over and over again. It's it's getting extremely boring, you know what I mean? So let's move on. To be fair with you, I want to kill the skeleton because I need the bones of the shitty dead, bones of the beast. That is drop. That was nice. <laughs> we died. We died. No. Nah, I've, I've been just knocked down. It's impossible to die. Or, if they are like cornering me, look where they are like cornering me. See this? Check this. How how the all this fight is happening? Because you are like, bro, bro. You get stuck in between that fucking. Bro, this game is shit. Bro. This game is pathetic. It's shit. It's like how the fuck? You get stuck there. You know what I mean? Here you get stuck in this shit. Look. You get stuck in between trees and shit like that. And they are like spawning and uh, all the enemies are attacking you. And you get like basically blocked there, you know, in between that. That plant is like spitting some shitty fire on you. You get knocked down. And the others are like just... You have all these fucking small pathetic things. You, you smash through barrels, you know what I mean? You are like breaking barrels down in things. And suddenly, this fucking small trees. If I'm kicking this, put a put a put it like this. If you have a tree in front of you with this size, and you kick it, you're gonna drop it down. You know what I mean? It's burnt already. You know that's the thing. Cause they are burned. Why this needs to block my character? Why it needs to block my character? This shit. Oh, now I'm stuck in it. <laughs> See, this game is a joke. That's what I'm telling you. I was trying to, to show you what, how. Because you see my spear. My spear is like the same thickness as, as this shit. But now I'm stuck here. 
At least you have the best unstuck button, but even though it's not saving the game from being like fucking bullshit. Much XP. Yeah, we are doing like plenty of experience here. But I don't understand why they plant all these trees, you know what I mean? All these fucking trees, because they are blocking you. Look at that. Even that NPC is blocked in that fucking tree, bro. Oh. Fuck it. Sneeze again. I guess I'm the developers. Yeah, so basically, this is the, this is the game in a nutshell. What you, see, you are seeing in this episode, you're gonna see in all episodes. Because the enemies are the same, the stories are retarded. That this, this one. That's everyone I managed to find. I'm afraid the rest are dead. You did what you could. These people and I, we won't forget your sacrifice. People said that the Chimera tried to hide in a cave in not far from here. You'll need bait to lure it out. Take this bundle. It's fresh lamb coated in pork fat. An aroma like that will surely lure that beast out of the deepest of depths. Thanks for the help. Try to get to the harbor and flee on the ship going as far away from here as possible. It should be a bit safer there. All right, we'll do that. Thank you for everything, Achilles. Once again, thank you for everything you did, Achilles. May luck and now we have the bait for the Chimera. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it here because uh, I'm feeling like a retard after playing this. Maybe I am a retard because I'm playing, I'm still playing this, but. We have 1.6 K HP, bro. That's, that's a chubby fucking number. Uh, but anyway guys, thanks a lot for watching, thanks for your patience as well, and uh, I'll see you in the next one, take care.